Okay, I have turned on the lights on the first floor. As you enter, it is a nine foot plate uh, carpet as you enter. And then this is linoleum. Overall, there's no weird smells, which I always like to, that's the first thing that you point out because of course it would be hard if there was to remove any kind of scents. Um, as you can see, this is designated to be a formal dining, but of course you can use, or your son can use however. Um, on the ceiling right here, there's some kind of bubble. Not sure what the cause of that would be. Maybe upstairs there's a bathroom over us. We'll have to see when we get there. Um, overall, nice open space here. Um, this is supposed to be, of course, the uh, kitchen nook. And then here is the kitchen. Formica countertops. Older appliances, but of course that can always be switched out. These are 30 inch cabinets, adjustable, pretty standard. Tile backsplash looks like 12 by 12. Same thing with the linoleum. This is kind of cool. I doubt that will stay. I'm sure your son might like that. Okay, and here's the utility room slash pantry. Same thing on the washer dryer. Um, most of the time, these things do not convey, so it's just a matter if you want to put it in the offer. Water heater, they have a freezer in here, so the good news is there's room for it. Let's take a look into the garage. So it is a one car garage. Of course, all of this would be removed um, once they move out. Pretty standard garage. You can always add a garage door opener, but as of right now, you can see there's not one there. Um, it is not plumbed for a water softener, but that can always be done. We have somebody who can um, give you uh, or install a water softener pre-plumbing so that if you did want to add that, you could. And then it opens up to the living space. So here is fireplace and really nice and open concept on the first floor. Um, these look like built-in speakers, which for surround sound, again, that'll be something your son will definitely like. So the paint here, as you can see, the, you know, they've separated each room. So here you have like a beige and a yellow from the living room to the kitchen. And then over here in the front area, it's kind of like a darker brown beige um, and yellow. And so it's not horrible. You can always, of course, uh, repaint. That's pretty simple. This is likely blocked and wired ready for a ceiling fan. Most of them are, uh, but does not come with a ceiling fan. And this is probably a storage. Oh no, this is the powder. Downstairs powder for the guests. One thing I do like about that, sometimes in a um, two-story home you have the powder literally right by or right in the kitchen and here it's just around the kitchen which is nice and the back yard is not much of a backyard but you know going to school full time he's not going to have time to maintain a big yard anyway and so here as you can see they've made it all cement and so um you only have the area which the trees create the privacy, which is kind of nice. And then you do have some back neighbors and a side neighbor here.
this fence is in great condition on this side. Um, so they've redone this side, but as you can see, the rear and the other side will eventually have to get replaced. Um, there's some fog in this, um, it looks like scratches. I don't know if you can see it, but it looks like scratches in the glass. Um, I'm not sure if it's condensation. It actually does look like scratches. I'm not sure what, have, what would have caused that. Okay, so this is the first floor. I'm gonna take a separate video of the second floor.